I, I indulged in Stormy's music. Technically speaking, he can rap really good. I mean, he actually is very talented with rap. Has very good bars. Got my young black queen. The hard part is an American. I don't know if this is just an American, but it's so it is quite a challenge getting past the accent that these UK rappers have when they're doing grime and drill. Like I'll be listening to it, and like I'm telling you, objectively speaking, they rap well, but it's just that accent. Is I don't know. It kind of like. To me, when I listen to it, I almost kind of feel like he's kind of making fun of rap. And I can tell he's passionate. I can tell he's really doing. I can tell he's really rapping. I'm just telling you personally speaking. Not objectively speaking, but personally when I digest the music, it sounds to me like he's like, he's like, he's like, it sounds like he's making fun of like a, like a nigga rapping in a, with a UK accent. I don't know. It just is weird to me. But I do think he's dope. I love that in hip hop, in the world of hip hop, you have all these subsets of hip hop that have started. I remember... Four years ago, I was bouncing at this nightclub, and they had a group come and play. There was this white hip-hop group. They did some brand of hip-hop. I forgot what it is. Some kind of offset of hip-hop. It is just weird and eerie. It's not like emo rap. I love emo rap. Emo emo rap. I'm right here with emo rap. I love it. I love listening to Limb Biscuit. Lil Peep was my nick. Lil Uzi Vert. I love emo rap. But they did some kind of rap where it was just like, and it, it i didn't know i was like what the fudge is this bruh i appreciate that sound has an audience even though i thought that they were summoning Makatulu and the devil and satan whatever else hells with that but i appreciate that it has an audience